In this video, we're going to use Simpson's rule to approximate the integral between 1 and 4 of e to the x over x using 6 strips. Okay, so first thing is I'm going to work out h, the width of each strip. So 4 take away 1 divided by the number of strips, so that would be 1 half. I'm then going to build up a table of results. So, uh, the x's are going to start at 1, and they're going to go up in halves. So we'll have 3 halves, then 2, then we're going to have 5 halves, then 3, then 7 halves, and then 4. So then I need to substitute these values in to my function e to the x over x. So just double check that you've got seven ordinates. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. So substituting in one, we're going to get e to the one over one, which is just e. Then e to the three halves over three halves. So two thirds e to the three halves. Then substituting in two, we're going to get one half e squared. Substituting in five halves, we'll have two fifths e to the 5 halves. Substituting in 3, we're going to get 1 third e cubed. Substituting in 7 halves, 2 sevenths e to the 7 halves. Then substituting in 4, 1 quarter e to the 4. Now for ease of substituting into the formula, I'm just going to write underneath, this is y0, y1, y2, y3, y4, y5 and y6 okay so this approximates to one third times h which is the one half times by we get y0 plus y6 the first plus the last e plus one quarter e to the four then you've got four lots of the odd ones so y1 y3 y5 so two thirds e to the three halves two fifths e to the 5 halves, and 2 sevenths e to the 7 halves. And then two lots of the even ones, so y2 and y4. So 1 half e squared plus 1 third e cubed. So now we need to plug this into our calculator and work it out. Now, best way of doing this would probably be to work out uh, these three bits inside the bracket first. Now we've got the one sixth, one third times a half. I'm going to do um, e plus a quarter of e four e to the four first. So that's going to get me sixteen point three six seven eight one nine three four. Okay, so that's that bit. So now this bit. So four lots of two thirds uh, e to the three halves plus two fifths e to the five halves plus two sevenths e to the seven halves. We should get sixty nine point two eight nine three nine two, and then we've got this bit. So two lots of one half e squared plus one third e cubed. And this is 20.779 All right. So I'm going to add these bits in the bracket. Okay, so one sixth of 106.436. So we should get 17.739437.56. Okay, now this might not be exact up to that point, just to be clear, but it will be accurate enough. So 17.7 to three significant figures. Now, of course, you would give it to the required number of significant figures that the question asks for. Uh, this one I didn't specify. 
and then I would want to go back to my integral and pop it into my integral solver to make sure I've got something that is reasonable. So 1 to 4. And we get 17.7357. So it's really close, OK? 17.7 to 3 sig fig. Uh, so it, Simpson's rule here gave me a value that was really close to what this is actually.